can't believe I'm actually filming at this nonsense hour, such as the life we chose. And of course, my legs always feel more comfortable when my legs are crossed. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Now, I do not believe that I'm actually doing this. It is literally like 4 a.m. It's three minutes to four in the morning and I decided that I was gonna film a video. Um, I actually went out today. Today was the uh, Cambridge ACS affair. So um, obviously ACS being the African Caribbean Society and they put on an amazing event today um, at the Hilton Hotel in Cambridge um, where we had like a three course meal and um, DJ Edot who came and shut it down. We danced, we took pictures, we had fun, it was it was so lit, like I can't even lie, I had a really, really good time tonight. So shout out to the president, Miss President, well she's not president anymore actually, she's now moved on to somebody else, but technically she's still president until the end of this, um, this academic year. Shout out to Courtney, Courtney Daniela, as you guys know her. Um, Cambridge ACS president here and to all of the team because honestly it was an amazing event. So um, yeah, I obviously got all I don't know if my face is still looking half decent right now. Sorry if my makeup is not looking 100 because obviously I've been out. Um, we've been out literally since six o'clock. Then we came back after the, the um, after the ACS affair, which finished at around quarter past 11. And then when we got back, there was an after party. Oh, just got a notification from Sprinkle of Jesus. It says, heartbreak may feel like it's the end of the world, but it's not. It's only the end of one word. Okay, Sprinkler Jesus. If you haven't got the Sprinkler Jesus app, by the way, I'll suggest you do. I love this app. Anywho, I was supposed to have done this video a long time ago, literally ages ago, but I just haven't had time to sit down and film it. But essentially, guys, I really don't have anything to complain. I know that I always sound like I don't really have anything to complain about hair, but I feel like the quality of hair, because now people know um, that you can get good quality hair, People in general, as in vendors who sell hair in general, know that the quality has to be good because they know that they, there's, if their hair's not good, that there's no competition because someone's gonna be able to buy good, decent hair. Um, so I can generally say to you, like, I don't have any complaints whatsoever about this hair. Um, as you can see, the waviness is still kind of, yeah, it's pretty much the same as when I first got it. Um, one thing that I really liked about this hair actually was the fact that it wasn't like wavy, like body wave, but it was like wave, like a beach wave. And I really like that. I like the fact that it's like a beach wave. Um, and it's kind of like a, I don't know, it makes me feel really like, really hot, really sexy. It's lasted pretty well, it's still full, it's still thick. It it barely gets tangled, but again, I think that's down to how I look after the hair. I feel like if you maintain hair and you look after it on a regular basis, so I wash my wigs about, on average, about every week and a half, two weeks. So I never go a long time without washing my wigs. And so it doesn't give it time to get all knotted and matted and all that kind of stuff. No, like, um, that just never happens. And I normally just literally do a shampoo, then I condition it twice. And most of the time I deep condition, so I literally leave the conditioner in overnight. And then when I wake up in the morning, wash it out, and then um, use like something like a serum or something, just so that the moisture can be locked in and to make sure that the hair is soft and really shiny um, when it dries. And then normally I just like to leave it to air dry. I think air dry is always the best thing for any type of weave, like extensions, whatever you want to call it. Um, I just feel like it just makes the hair much nicer. So that's what I do. Um, but yeah, honestly, this hair is gorgeous. As you can see, um, this obviously you guys know it was a closure, but I kind of like faked a frontal. Um, but later on, I decided to actually tweeze, um, as you can see, I don't know how much you can see, but oops. But I actually decided to tweeze like the parting. Um, and so now I've, I've got basically like a parting now and there's a, like, my edges are obviously there. Um, it's a bit messy right now, just because obviously I've been out for a few hours. Now it's looking a bit, I don't even think the baby edges are even sitting down properly because um, yeah, I've been like out and sweating and stuff, so I don't even think it looks nice. Basically, like, I love the hair. I think 
it's absolutely great i cannot remember what um i actually got in terms of what i ordered but i'll put everything in the description box below so make sure you check it out um to find out exactly what lengths i've got in my hair and how many bundles and all that kind of good stuff so yeah look in the description box below but I genuinely, like, I'm trying to actually think, like, if I've had any issues. And I genuinely haven't. I think, actually, at one point, um, I can say that it got a bit fluffy. Like, so it got a bit, like, frizzy. So you see how it, the hair, the hairs look a bit like a, is a bit of like a wet look. That kind of beach waves type of look. Um, there was a point where it got a bit fluffy. But again, I think it's just because I didn't wash it for a while. I hadn't washed um the wig for a while and also i've changed my wash routine now for my hair i'm using different products now and these products are proving a million times better so i think that's literally it so um yeah i'm going to show you the products in a second as to what i use now for all my wigs and all that kind of stuff but in terms of the hair guys i really don't have many complaints it just all depends on how well you look after the hair i love the hair right now i love how it's just <laughs> that's all i have to say about the hair like guys so far so good it's been a good few months now i'm sure it's been over three maybe four months anywho that's the hair all done but i'm gonna move on to the products so i have absolutely fallen in love with care um i started using it after uh mandy uh was using these products and i basically ran out of shampoo and stuff and i went to her and i stole these i used it in my straight weave in my straight wig and i swear to you i did not wash that wig for about two maybe literally going on three weeks and bearing in mind i said that the best way um, to ensure that my hair looks good is when I wash my wigs at least a week and a half, two weeks pushing it. But the hair was still swinging, it was still doing the most. Why? Because of these products. So I'm um, just kind of like to go over it quickly. One thing that I will say is that it is a little bit more pricey. Not pricey in the sense that it's like £20 per bottle, but like obviously if you go to a normal drugstore, drugstore you know like something like super drugs or um boots or whatever you'll find shampoos for like two pounds these are kind of a bit more expensive so number one the care care first lather so this first lather basically um just strips the hair like like a normal shampoo um it strips the hair but it was 5.99 which is kind of expensive for shampoo and it's only 240 milliliters like look it looks like a small bottle like literally it's a small bottle and you're thinking 5.99 but um yeah it strips the hair initially of all the dirt the grime anything that was on that wig will be gone with this so then comes number two which is the moisturizing conditioner which is amazing it makes my hair my wigs feel so smooth um and actually this particular wig actually i um did an overnight condition i did a deep condition so i literally left this on the hair overnight and then the next day after it like gone really dry as in not the hair had gone dry but as in because obviously i put this in it it had gone dry and then i washed it out and yeah this is how my hair basically came out and then to end we have number three which is the care care oil Mo oil moisturizer again just kind of locks in moisture and um, make sure that your hair is feeling soft and smooth this was five and six ninety nine one thing though i will warn you use the tiniest amount of this on my straight wig I went overboard with it i used a bit too much and it just made my hair feel like it made it look like it was wet when it wasn't wet so it made it look wet but greasy um and you could tell it was soft it was very soft but it just was stick i don't know how to describe it but basically i made a very very big mistake but with this one i used only a little bit but at the same time i probably even used more than i should have but i like the look that it's given the hair it's given the hair that kind of wet kind of like almost sticky kind of look even on the bottle it says directions distribute sp um sparingly throughout wet or dry hair and massage onto scalp and then in capital letters it says avoid using too much Mate, it was telling me in capital letters to avoid using too much. Me being me though, I always go overboard. So literally use the tiniest amount of this moisturizer. Um, otherwise, when you go overboard, it just doesn't make the hair feel or look nice. So um, 
yeah use the tiniest amount however um mandy has this other serum as well it's like the lock and something serum also by care care that i wanted to get because that made my hair just the bomb but i just couldn't find it in the shop it was really really annoying but yeah those are the three products that i've absolutely fallen in love with at the moment care care is so dope as i've mentioned i really do have no problems at all with this hair obviously the hair from uni's hair and um, who had sent me over a few bundles to try out and i genuinely have no complaints and i'm even more happy now because i've got my new um wash routine but um i hope that you enjoy this video and i really do hope that you enjoy the little review on the hair and on the products as well i will link everything in the description box below so do not worry yourself make sure you check out uni's hair both on instagram and on their website and of course like always make sure you like subscribe and share to all my stuff you beautiful wonderful people but yeah I'm really tired now so thank you so much guys i'll see you guys again in my next video love you stay beautiful oh my god it was like a track hanging okay well awkward guys if there was a track like hanging out this um came loose just as i was about to leave there's like a track that's just a little bit loose here remember this week i made on my own so <laughs> don't expect it to be the best of week that is highly embarrassing but guess what it happens so <laughs> listen my question is why are you the baddest in the game <laughs>